Picture this. You're standing on a mountain, which creates this beautiful peak that rises up from the landscape. Now here's where it gets interesting. You can't just walk anywhere on this mountain. Instead, you're restricted to follow this specific yellow path that circles around the peak, and your goal is to find the highest point you can reach while staying on this allowed path. That red dot you see is exactly where you want to be, the optimal point where you achieve maximum height while respecting your constraint. So the natural question is, how do we actually find this special point mathematically? Let's transition from our three-dimensional mountain view down to a cleaner two-dimensional perspective, where we can really see what's happening. Here we have our function f of x, comma y equals 8 minus x squared minus y squared plotted on standard x, y axis. When you're trying to maximize a function without any constraints, the strategy is pretty straightforward. You just follow the gradient. These blue arrows show the gradient field and they all point toward the direction of steepest increase. If you start anywhere and keep following these arrows, you'll trace out a path that leads you straight to the peak, which for our function sits right at the origin where x equals 0 and y equals 0. But now let's bring back our constraint. 